If you're using Cloud Code, then let me show you three tips that you might not know about to help you out next time you use it. Now, Cloud Code is terminal based. So when you close that terminal window, you lose that conversation. However, you can use the command Claude with the resume flag, and this will give you access to all the conversations that you've had with Claude for that specific project or repository that you're working within. Now to improve the experience with Claude, you should always have a Claude.md file. Once you're within Claude, you can use the command slash init to have Claude scan your entire project and build out this file. Then Claude code automatically reads this file and follows these instructions throughout your session, ensuring consistent behavior across all conversations within your project. Now, if you're working within a conversation for a while, then you should utilize the clear command. If you've been working on multiple tasks, then Claude might reference that old content and it could skew the responses that you get. Using this will give Claude a new slate to focus on the current task without interference from previous work. Now, not only will this give you better results, but it also speeds up Claude's output by reducing the context it needs to process, saving both time and tokens. Now for one last bonus tip, if you've been noticing that Claude code has been providing less than ideal responses, it might be due to the model that you're currently using. Once you're within Claude inside of your terminal, you can use the command slash model. By default, Claude code is going to use Sonnet 4, which can provide less than ideal responses. Now personally, I have found that using Opus is going to provide you with better results, especially for those more complex tasks. Now if you found this helpful, be sure to follow and like for more tips like this.